meeting. We're at the NRA annual meeting 2016 in Louisville, Kentucky. Don't forget to check in down below. Check in down below. Where are you in the world? All right, let's get right to it uh, because we are on the road and we got to get out on the floor. A couple of weeks ago, we talked about living in a lifeboat. Are you just existing? Are you just floating along with the waves or do you have direction? And I said that you should set goals or tell us what your goal is. What I want you guys to do, step number one, determine short-term goals. What are you going to do this year? Write it down. Actually take, don't use your phone. Take a writing stick, okay, a pen. Take dead tree and write down your one-year goal, whatever it happens to be, whether it's your, for your life, for your business, what have you, fitness, you name it. Five-year goals, what do you hope to accomplish in five years? Write that down. 10-year goals, same thing, actually write it down. Write it down, read it, and then you can go ahead and put it away. But the fact is you need to write it down, and the act of writing it down will indel it in the back of your memory. Now, from a personal standpoint, I did this. A good friend of mine told me when I was in the Marine Corps many, many moons ago, he said, Paul, you need to write down your goals. I said, okay, I will. I'll listen to you. So I wrote down my goals in a spiral notebook. Wrote them all down. I wrote my one year, five year, 10 year goals down. And I put that notebook up. I actually changed the duty stations, went away. I got out of the Marine Corps. I found that notebook. I opened it up. And I realized that with the exception of one goal, I had achieved every single one of my one year and five year goals. Because when I found it, it was only like five or six years. What does that mean? Well, you need to improve, or excuse me, you need to challenge yourself. And one way to challenge yourself is to examine your life, what is important to you. Now some things that may have seemed important to you yesterday aren't going to be important tomorrow. And that's where you have to take a look at your life and examine it. Set goals, help yourself meet those goals. Now the kid on the other side of the camera, he's been doing a fantastic job helping you meet fitness and training goals. Jared, yeah. where should they write to you? Uh, well, one, I want you to post your goals in the bottom down below in the comments. And two, you can write to me at jared at studentofthegun.com, J-A-R-R-A-D, at studentofthegun.com, and I will follow up with you once a month, about once a month, just to make sure that you're continuing on your path to reaching your goals. Okay, so if you, after two weeks, you said, yes, I am that guy, I'm just floating around in a lifeboat, I don't really have any serious direction. Examine your life, what are your priorities, what do you hope to accomplish? Write down a one-year goal or several one-year goals. Write them down physically. Five-year goals, same thing. Ten-year goals, same thing. Put them away. Put them somewhere where you can find them later and read them. Set yourself a compass. Set yourself a direction. That's what it is. All right. We're going to go my, back into the my goal, annual meeting. Yeah, my goal right now is to get coffee, and I really wish I had an Oxbox. Woo! All right. And we're going to be posting throughout the weekend, so pay attention. Oxbox, get one. Ox Beyond Rugged on Facebook, on Twitter, on everything. And we're going to be giving one away at the end of this month. So share yes. yeah. and post. Share this post. Share and post. Tag two people. Is that it? Yep. All right. Peace out.